News from the showrooms and design studios of the automotive world, this is Fastlane Daily. I'm Tina Beth Pina with your automotive briefing. If you thought Hyundai only made cheap transportation, this may come as a shock. Images of Hyundai's luxurious new concept car hit the online earlier today. It's known as the Genesis, and it's the first hint at Hyundai's new rear-wheel drive luxury sedan. Hyundai says the Genesis is benchmarked against the BMW 5 Series and Mercedes E-Class, but the production model will hit dealerships at a fraction of the price. It'll even come with a V8. The new 4.6-liter engine is expected to produce more than 300 horsepower. It'll also propel the large sedan to 60 miles per hour in around 6 seconds. We'll get the first look at the Hyundai Genesis concept at the New York Auto Show next month. Not sure how to spend that fortune in Google stock? Aston Martin may soon have an answer. According to the UK's Auto Express, Aston is plotting a new high-buck supercar to sell in the mid-six-figure range. It's called the DBX. Auto Express says the DBX will be powered by a 6.0-liter V12 producing upward of 700 horsepower. That added power means a 0-60 to 60 time of 3.7 seconds and a top speed of more than 200 miles per hour. No word yet on a release date, and that means you still have time to make that first billion. Next up, did Mother Nature intrude on a top speed record run? More after this. Did you hear they're making MGs in China? Who told you that? Tina Beth. Did you hear the new BMW M3 comes with a carbon fiber roof? Who told you that? Tina Beth. Did you hear about the new Corvette SS prototype? Who told you about that? Tina Beth. Hi, I'm Tina Beth Pina. Be the first to share news from the showrooms and design studios of the automotive world, Fast Lane Daily. Always fresh, every day. Got a story for Fast Lane Daily or even a hot tip? Rumor? Forum Flame War? We want to know about it. Give us a call at 213-291-1883 or tips at FastLaneDaily.com. American supercar builder SSC spent last week preparing for a shot at the world production car speed record. The company was set to run its ultimate aero TT supercar flat out on a 12 mile stretch of Nevada roadway, but mother nature wasn't on board. After a freak snowstorm hit the area, SSC broke camp and moved to an alternate stretch 30 miles away. Once there, the crew found only two of the designated nine miles smooth enough to run the arrow flat out. But they took a shot. The arrow clocked in at 230 miles per hour, which wasn't a record, but driver Rick Doria says he did it at only 56% throttle in sixth gear. If that's the case, the arrow could have a real shot at surpassing the Bugatti Veyron's record of 253 miles per hour. SSC says another shot at the record could happen in as soon as two weeks. That wraps up Fastlane Daily for today. Tune in tomorrow when we'll see if BMW can build a 1988 Hyundai XL concept car. See ya!